A new robotic device called Tech RMD is being hailed as a breakthrough for those who are disabled. New tonight, CBS 13's Adrian Moore explains how this device is helping people stand tall and regain their independence. Four wheels, elastic straps, and a joystick. I turn the unit on and then I turn the key fob on. So now I can actually operate it all by myself. Are rolling out a new sense of freedom for Bill Winchester. This handle raises it up. This handle shakes the shock. So I'll probably try to bring myself most if I can. As tight as I can for the most part. I'll squeeze this handle. And stand up. While training for a bike race last year, the Truckee Meadows Fire Department captain struck an illegally parked trailer, leaving him paralyzed from the chest down. In the beginning stages, I lost a lot of self-confidence. So I'm trying to gain that back as much as possible. New technology from the Tech RMD is part of that solution. It's a Segway-like device that allows people with spinal cord injuries to stand and move upright. So it allows me to get that confidence, that self-confidence, that ability to be recognized as a adult standing, the mental element, looking eye to eye to somebody is a tremendous mental and moral accomplishment. The avid athlete has been able to stand up in physical therapy, but this 200 pound mobility robot allows him to navigate through his house with greater ease than a traditional wheelchair. Many homes, especially the older homes, they have really narrow bathrooms. They're usually 24 or 25 inches wide. Well, my chair is 24 to 25 inches wide. So if I can't get in the bathroom, I've got to figure out what to do. He gave us a tour of his home to show us the difference it makes. So, I mean, before I can't even reach this. I can't even set the controls on the oven. But now I can. I can actually get into the oven. The pantry, this is probably my favorite part because I like to eat. I can grab vegetables, I can grab canned goods, I can grab you know anything off the top shelf middle shelf and then what the nice thing is is with this machine is because I have the ability to sit back down I can sit back down and grab stuff on the bottom shelf I can wash my hands I can now brush my teeth I can do my hair stand up do my hair whatever I need and the sink allows me when I'm standing up to do those simple things in life that you take for granted According to the National Spinal Cord Injury Statistical Center, 270,000 Americans live with an SCI. Back at Bill's house, it's simple moments like these. So what I try to do is make my kids dizzy. That means so much more and allow a sense of pre-accident life to stand tall in the face of paralysis.